What's up, Scrollgers? It's Nerp here, and I was lucky enough to just log in and complete silence, accepted my surprise challenge. So yes, uh, I uploaded last video of my my whole um, stats video on my cards a little early. What is this card do again? Okay, we don't need that. This is my late game order Arbalest Year only deck. So no manganels for clearing. I just have to rely on my Arbalest Year and it can get massive attack with the Resonant Swords. And I have no idea what Complete Silence is playing here. Um, don't need a folk. Eh, I'll get rid of a Precious Rule right now. And yeah, I'm going to go for the Paw there just for the, the cantrip because I'd like to play something next turn. Oh, there we go. Good pot there, I drew an infiltrate. So, yeah, I actually uh, went away for the week, um, last week. So I recorded a bunch of videos in advance, including that l Final Scrolls video, just in case it was the Final Scrolls video. But I guess the servers are still up past July 1st and they'll just go away sometime in the future. <laughs> I don't know, but until then, I guess I could still have some fun with the game. So, good thing there were like 25 people online, so. I've seen it worse recently. Maybe, uh. Maybe the recent 24 hour scroll stream kind of revitalized it. Uh. If you can hear that, that's actually fireworks. If you could hear the booms. Because I'm recording this on the 4th of July, which is American Independence Day. But. You know what's more interesting than watching fireworks? Playing scrolls. Um, this Ducal Spearman is actually perfect. I don't want. I don't really want it to get poisoned though. I think I'm just gonna kabonk this. Or I'll. I'm gonna get rid of the resonant sword here. I'm just gonna play the scholar. It's not like this is really a threat to deal idle damage. I don't. I don't need to kabonk it right away. Um, I will take the. Hmm. In case I don't draw an Arbalest here, I should probably take the Royal Inspiration. You already have a Tempo Theft in deck in my hand, so I'd, it's not like a pressing need for a speed. But, yeah. It's not a huge deal that I showed you guys my like final stats uh, a bit early. I'm not going to play that many more games before the game ends. Really, all my games played are on um are recorded so if anybody wants to hit me up for a challenge just comment and i'd be happy to play you before the game uh, officially goes away okay so now we have an easy uh oh, what do i sacrifice here i'd hate to get rid of a second resident sword already so i'm gonna get rid of the royal inspiration we're not going to play an Arbalest Steer that soon. I'm pretty content with the Ducal Spearman here to protect this dude, the Ace Morn Scholar. Yeah, sometimes there's not a lot of players online for me to <laughs> get into a match to, so if any of you guys want to play, I'd be more than happy to record a video of our duel. Next turn, I won't quite have enough uh, uh, resources to Imperial, um, so I'll probably Kabonk his Rat, and then maybe I'd top deck something useful, or I still will top deck something at the beginning of the turn. See what I can find. Underdog Spite and Curse Presence. Okay, that's gonna clear my row. So that's good for him I guess and there's an Arbalister um might as well play her right <laughs> yeah might as well play it's a big body rather than just kamaking for no reason I'm actually going to get rid of the tempo theft yeah I'm going to get rid of the tempo theft here 
because I don't want to get rid of the other resonance sword, and a Kabak is just so useful against what his deck seems to be an aggro, an aggro, uh, decay growth, uh, deck. So next turn, I'll be able to play Imperial Resources, heal my idols a little bit, and I'll be on my way towards victory, hopefully. Hopefully I top deck something not so useful so I don't have to make a tough decision of what to sacrifice next turn to play the Imperial. Probably the Kabank, but I don't know. Okay. It's going to be hard for me to get down there. Okay, I'll get rid of the focus here, although it's pretty useful. And let's go for the Imperial resources. Okay, I have an Arbalister Speed. That was a great top deck. Um... Unfortunately, I'm not ramped up quite that high yet. So, next turn. An Arbalister Speed doesn't make an attack. You need an Arbalister Tempo Theft. Um, wow, that, that fireworks is getting really loud. I hope it's not <laughs> bothering you guys. Okay. Wonder. Actually. I can see it out this window. No, I can't. Okay. Um, well, why did he just move up? Now I can kill some things of his. Uh, the third resonant sword. Hmm. Well, I don't have to play Resonance Sword on that. The Arbalister Speed. This one will not go off. That's annoying. If this one go off, that'd be good. If I wish I wish I had that Tempo Theft right now. That'd be perfect. Well, not perfect, but I'm gonna have to get rid of a Resonance Sword. I think. As much as I hate to do it, I love the giant attack arbor steers, but we gotta do what we gotta do. And let's get a low cost spell. Uh, okay, well. I'll kabonk and hope for a. Hope for a spell. <laughs> That's not speed. Pother, there we go. That is what I wanted to see. So I will pother this. Hopefully it goes up. If it goes down, it's not too bad. Either, but then it can't attack me. Just don't go here. Okay, so we get a little hit on that. And then perfect. We topped like a Dougal Spearman to protect my Arbalister. That's pretty sweet. No Kabonk in my hand to finish the job on that Brave, though. And next turn, I think this Ducal Spearman will buy us a bit of time to pull off another Imperial and pull out further ahead. Hope so. Hope so. If I can, I'll try to drop Heritage on that before it dies, but I don't know. This, this deck of Complete Silence is like, it's like a Gojo's kind of deck. Next turn, I guess I'll probably just, uh, he's probably going to destroy that. Maybe, no, he can't Crimson Bull. I wonder what he's doing here. Unforeseen Onslaught. Aha. Okay, so that's kind of deck he's playing. This is an Unforeseen Onslaught deck. Okay, what do they even do again? Increase it with one or less. Okay. Um, now I'm going to... I mean, these are all low attack creatures. I can probably pull off another Imperial before I do anything. Imperial resources. And what do you know? Top to a Kabank. Perfect for that Brave. This is going my way, I think. 
Uh, I'll get rid of Heritage because we have nothing really on the board to put Heritage on right now. Come on, Q. And, okay, we're pretty set up now. I got my combo. I got the Arbalister, Tempo Theft, Arbalister, Resonance Sword, Tempo Theft to make a 7 attack Arbalister. Um, if I can ramp up even more, I could do more than that. And playing like Gleeky Mordor decks, you just feel so in control. Kinfo Brave, okay, he's wisely not lining his units up. You know, I'm I'm not feeling that threatened right now, so I might actually not Kabonk. Uh You know, I think I'm gonna hold off on the whole Arbalester thing. Well, I could Arbalester. No, I probably should do it. Arbalester Resonance. That's six, seven, ten. I'm gonna hold off. I'm just gonna go with an infiltrate right now. Righteous Partisan is exactly what I want to draw. And then I'll, uh, hmm. And I'll sacrifice the speed. Yeah, I like my other cards. I'll have enough resources now that I could probably make my Arbalesters go off uh, without having to use... Nope, oh, I'm running out of time, actually. Whoops. Probably should have Kabonks first before sacrificing, but it didn't really matter because I top decked a speed after my sacrifice. A little mistake. But it's okay. Alright. And. He's really not going any higher in resources. If he's not going to line up his uh, creatures, I'm just going to have to um, take him out one by one, I guess. The only issue is I don't know what units he has that, I don't know what units I have in the deck that are not, um, I think I only have Righteous Partisan, Arbalester, um, what is this, Essence Scar. When a creature comes to play, Jason, no, plus 2-2. Two, two. Okay, well let's get rid of this now. So, do I have any cantrips? Sure. Arbalester. Resonance Sword. I will go ahead and stop this from attacking, I guess. Yeah, sure. Well, you know what? We're going to poly this, actually. So I will just actually go with the speed. Speed, followed by get rid of the other speed. I want to keep my units. And poly for the three-quarter chance of going in front of these two things. Yes. Beautiful. That is how you do it. And next turn, I have a Arbalester Tempo for wherever I want to put it. And I should be able to replenish my hand with cards with the Prisoners of War. Ragged Wolf. Deathly Grasp. Okay, so that, I think that just gives it a Slayer straight up. Okay. It's kind of tough because I'm losing those big units so quickly, but... 
Okay, I don't think I need to be doing any fancy things this turn. I'm just gonna go with the Prisoners of War. Um, Ragged Wolf, I'll keep. Uh, get rid of the. Well, let's play this. I'll play the Ragged. Um, I'll get rid of the mangy for scrolls and a scholar. Uh, oh, whoops! I didn't realize that was that would go off after that. That's kind of annoying, isn't it? Um, I'll go ahead and protect this idol, just because I don't want him getting dominion. Or actually use my resources more efficiently. Now I'll protect the idol with the spiky dude. Okay. I'm so used to drawing a card at the end of the turn now uh, from Duelist that I forget how scrolls works. Those lynxes. I made those lynxes attack. I mean, feels like I'm kind of just like. It's just a draw knock game. I think it's pretty much decided. Because he's such an aggro deck with low uh, a low resource curve, this, I thought there's anything in his deck for him to be able to come back. I'm just so ramped up. It's probably time for me to just get an Arbalister out and try to t attack almost every turn. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and do that. Um, I will... Get rid of the copper automaton. K. K is cool. Um, I'll go ahead and do the arbalist here, though. I will put him second. I'm just going to line up this whole row. I will tempo theft the ragged wolf so I can't attack yet. And I'll follow up by placing another spearman for more idle protection. Oh, and that makes the, both of those attack. The spearman. And all of a sudden, I actually have more units on the board than him. And now it's just a matter of time until I'm able to Ancestral Pact. Well, he's going to draw some cards here. But he's out of cards. Pestis. Okay, well, he'll draw a Mangy Rat when this dies. Oh, summon a Mangy Rat. Okay. It's time to get the K out, I think. Uh, let's start with Prisoners of War, because I can actually do both of those this turn. So, Prisoners of War... And then I will. No, I don't! Sorry about the yell. I'll get rid of the main G rat for order. I will hit this. Destroy the main G rat with. Actually, I should probably destroy that with. I shouldn't use the riot wolf, I guess. I'll play K. And. I guess I will end up with one extra resource. And I'll draw a card from something dying and I had K on the board. Okay. And now we are so ramped up. Owl. Kinfolk Brave. Okay, I'm going to get rid of the copper automaton. No, I don't! No, I don't! Okay, so now I'm going to... I could play this and get another RB. I don't think I really need to, though. I'm kind of content with still ramping. So I'll go with the Imperial. Okay. 
Actually, I should. I'll, I'll go with the Royal Inspiration. So then I'll play an Arbalest Deer. Tempo Theft on this. This hits that. And then I'll get rid of this for cards. Can't play anything else, unfortunately. Bam, and you draw some cards there, but. I will win soon, I promise. Imperial resources combined with a bunch of spells will make them both attack next turn and I might be able to win. Yeah, I can kind of do like mindless like plays now. I don't really have to worry. I'm so far ahead in resources, cards. Uh, he hasn't destroyed any idols. That many, many, many misplays would cause me to lose this game. Rat King. That's a good uh, thing for the Unforeseen Onslaught. Sorry about that sound. Okay. Now, let's do this. I'll just go for order. I might have lethal. I'm just going to go for the Imperial. Uh, resonance sword, I guess, on one of these things. Um, I'm just gonna go for idols now. Focus. I might not have another thing to play though. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that. Focus. And then I'll go for a, I guess go for a pile there, see a draw corn, please be a spell. No spell, unfortunately. Oh well. Well, I'm going to destroy middle idol there. And I'm ready to maybe win the game next turn. It'd be good if I drew that Royal Inspiration. Then, actually I still wouldn't have won the game would have taken I think a focus for me to win the game because then this uh this Arbluster would have enough damage to destroy the idol and this one would have more than enough because of the resident sword. So I was slightly miscalculated there. But like I said, I don't have to don't have to make the perfect plays at this point in the game. Not a lot uh, that's gonna go wrong for me. So um yeah, uh, I'm mostly units in my hand right now, so it's not like I can get this thing's attack up that high as it stands. Yeah, well that's just fodder. It's going to die like so quickly. And a mangy rat. Okay, I think I just, uh, since I'm not sure if I can win next turn. First of all, what I top deck? Infiltrate. Uh, don't think I can win still. So I'll just go ahead and. Prisoners of. Actually, I'll play Royal Inspiration. Um. Playing RB. Then I'll go ahead and infiltrate. Kabonk. Does focus get me anywhere? Um, I don't think it gets me anywhere. Oh, we're gonna have to uh, not win this turn. 
and then I will just you know I will focus here though because I just want to get this game to move on I win this and I don't think it's gonna be possible for him to win the game this turn I mean, maybe with the unfortunately an onslaught, onslaught, it can actually clear a whole bunch of my board. Maybe that was unwise not destroying that middle row. I guess Ancestral Pact is his main card drawing mechanism. Next turn, I guess, uh, I mean, I can... Play the Prisoners of War and get a Copper Auto, which deals a bunch of damage. But I have no like speed to make it go off or Tempo Theft. He did run out of cards pretty quickly. Okay. Rat King. And then. That's gonna help block that idol. It's kinda of annoying. Iron Bile. Well, goodbye, K. Now, can I get. The, I can. Yeah, I can get the three to attack, right? That's gonna be game, I believe. Maybe. Hopefully, I need to draw spells. Let's find spells. Um, Pother's a spell. So, Pother, Royal Inspiration, um, Prisoners of War, and Tempo Theft. GGWP final. So that'll be it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the background fireworks. Um, be bad if uh, it bothered you guys, but yeah. So thanks for watching. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more content, and I will see you next time. Keep on scrolling, scrollers.